Good afternoon, everyone. My name is, well, I'll introduce, I'm Larry, one of the um, crash test dummies. If that helps, let's meet with a picture of you. Um, my name is Lawrence Clifford Hatcher, and uh, I say that proudly. I, I have no need to uh, drop my head behind that. Um, the reason I'm here is because um, I did a little bit of research on you, sir, and um, you used to be a teacher, and I think that's admirable, don't you? You know, a teacher. That told me a lot about your character. I wanted to know who you are. And the second outstanding thing um, is you're an admirer of Lincoln, Abraham Lincoln. And um, I, too, have been a admirer of Lincoln since I was a kid. Very wise man. He was a good man. And um, I did a little bit of research on him, too. And he's from your home state, Illinois. And Lincoln, he um, reviewed 1,600 cases of military justice during the Civil War. And anyone, you're probably familiar with his background, he had a lot of problems with his generals initially. And um, any leader of a great organization may encounter such a thing. And uh, what Lincoln did, he pardoned many people who had been accused of desertion or cowardice or whatever. And um, what I'm here to do today is hopefully invoke the spirit of Lincoln. You mentioned CFC. Well, likewise, the spirit of Lincoln, his sagacity and his wisdom. I said my name is Lawrence Hatcher, and I don't drop my head. And the reason I say that is because... In the springtime, I uh, unjustly was accused, and I'll say this, I won't look at everyone. I was unjustly accused of sexual harassment, intentionally committing this crime, and I was guilty, according to them. My family and I, my family such as it is, is very small. While most of you were enjoying our Memorial Day holiday, we were panicked. The shock, the injustice of it, and it didn't make sense. And the backdrop of this accusation against me was done because I had originally complained, made some out of the chain of order complaints against my immediate manager. They subsequently denied this, just as I'm coming here and I'm saying, well, look, something's wrong here. Please, someone step in. They denied all this. They had nothing to do with this um, complaint that was filed against me. But w one of the things that they did say is that um, it's right here in red. They said that another reason why I believe that your conduct was intentional is you have failed to exhibit any remorse. Can any of you imagine being accused of a crime and judged on it simply because you showed no remorse, particularly if you're innocent? Well, a lot of other things have been done. And I know that there are other people here who have issues and matters that they'd like to bring to your attention. I'm not going to go all into detail because, well, that's not a class act there. But I have everything, and hopefully someone will look into this matter and give us the justice that we truly deserve, sir. That's well, bring, bring the envelope up here, set it down, and I'll be happy to look at it. One more thing, and I'm not going to okay, give this you know to what, you. know Lawrence? Yes. I'm going to give you about another minute. If you have a question, I'll be happy to answer it. I'll be happy to look at the material. No problem. A minute ball. I thought you'd like that. All right. Why don't we take a question up here? If you just set it there, I'll make sure I look at it. Thank you. Uh, 